Okay, so the first thing you people are going to ask, what the fuck is this? Yeah, I don't actually know that. I got this one alongside uh, Player Unknown Battleground. And it was like one euro or something like that. And I thought that, hey, it, either it's good at laughing at, or it can be a decent experience. So that is actually what we're going to try and find out. We're going to start in the career mode, me knowing absolutely nothing about this game. And so far, it pretty much feels like a game from the mid thousands, really. I mean, with the free slots for names and everything like that. Well, call ourselves Raven, after Raven Shield. Raven Shield being the best Rainbow Six title. That may actually be a... Okay, so we don't have any of this, whatever that, that is. We have a number of these, I don't know what that is. And it doesn't actually seem... It doesn't seem like we have a team, so... We should apparently recruit our own team, so here we can switch... I, I'm not actually sure if we can switch their photo or not. Let's call him Fuse. Ooh, sweet. We now have Fuse on our team. And then we can recruit Vermite. Then we can recruit, let's say, Thatcher. And I don't have enough money for that. Uh, apparently this police department only has a budget for... For two soldiers at the most. And apparently we don't have the money to... Yeah, we did have the money to buy... Uh, silence submachine gun for Fermite. Uh, uh, no, wait, for Fuse. Fuse got the silence submachine gun, it seems. And. Yeah. Can't really argue with the equipment so far. And here we have the missions we have training warehouse, training story house, training multiple rooms, training open rooms, and then we'll have the operations. But I think we'll actually go to. Fer yeah. We'll go to the tutorial with Fuse as team leader. Hopefully that will give us some more money Thanks to build to the rest me. of the team. We're good to go. Move when ready. I can't argue with how it looks, really. <sighs> or rather, I can. The shadows are atrocious, but... Hey, let's just go with it. See what we can do. Weapon models could be worse. There's something very familiar about that MP5 sound. I mean, really familiar. I'm trying to figure out where I heard it before, but... Alright, so... Apparently, we need to actually hold the button. My aim defines what kind of order I can give a check. How do I give the orders? Because Fermite is right now very useless. Come on, Fermite. You need to move in and shoot those guys. And here's how we change weapons. Look at that flash muzzle! I mean, just look at that fucking flash muzzle! This is atrocious! And the guy... The gun sound itself is not that convincing. It's Counter-Strike! Please tell me I'm wrong, but th this is Counter-Strike! This is the Counter-Strike silenced... silenced weapon effect, and now we've, now we've shot everything. And apparently the tutorial doesn't really care about where we're going, but apparently it has... every person on this map has an imitation level. It can go up or down. Hopefully that means we can actually arrest people. To arrest someone, interact with weapons. You can select your whole team. Oh. Apparently I ordered Fuse to use flashbangs, but... And there's the light, and there's the night goggles, but we don't have any night nice goggles. Prepare for entry. Ooh, I can actually order Fermite to prepare for entry. That's pretty sweet. 
Now we'll see what kind of pathfinding this game have. Yeah, he's actually moving. He's moving carefully. Can't argue with that. He's also moving very carefully into a box. <sighs> I'm not. Uh, oh, look at the clipping. His elbow clipped through the box too. Uh, why am I subjecting myself to this? Okay, so interact. Try and open the door. Try opening the door. Roger that. Door is locked. Oh, and you ch you, you felt the door after. So use lockpick. Lock Copy that. This is basically a game trying to be SWAT for. Door unlocked. And it's not really good at it. Open and clear. Clearing. Get down on the ground now. Oh god, we don't we don't I don't I don't actually <laughs> I died during the first tutorial mission. I died during the first tutorial mission. I'm never gonna live this down. At least we get our soldiers back, so let's just replay it and see what happens. On training missions you don't lose officers if they die. That being said, it seems like we actually lose officers if they die. Otherwise. And dangerous. Go with caution. Okay, so... Yeah, the M4 weapon model was actually a bit better. And the weapon sound doesn't seem to be taken straight from Counter-Strike. That's a plus. However, I feel it's a bit too small. They're trying to create some kind of depth of field effect, but they're not really succeeding. And why do I only have a s one spare mag for this thing? Either way, let's just go. We know what to do. Prepare for entry. Reloading. Oh god, another game with the impossible fast reloading. We'll just wait for Fuse to eventually go here. Yeah, do you see this animation switching the weapons? I want to make sure you pay close attention to what happens when I switch the weapons. Seriously. I mean, this is Red... I can't even remember the name of it. It was also an atrocious tactical shooter. Uh... Try opening the door. Understood. Door is open. Door wasn't open before, but okay, flash it. Open, flash and clear. Die you. Drop your weapon. I'm hit. Hands I'm go. Die here. I died again. I can't believe it. No, I died it. I die died here. again. Seriously. This game see doesn't give me a break. We'll play as Fuse and let's f either that or... I mean, did you see the progress? He didn't actually wait for the flash grenade to explode. And it, there was a lot of smoke. L I mean, like I had thrown a smoke grenade. Reloading. Reloading. Prepare for entry. I wish that guy would hurry up. I mean, half of the video is just gonna be us waiting here. Oh, and of course, switching is almost instantaneous. It also says that I am preparing to use flashbang, but... I'm actually not, and there's no way for me to actually use the mirror here. Move fast. Got it, boss. Oh, I had to actually order him to move fast. Grenade out. Oh god! Okay, so prepare for entry. Got it, boss. Try opening the door. Copy that. Door is open. Grenade out. As you might understand, I'm trying to throw the grenade over the door. Uh, 
Let's see if this Open works. Clear. Go! Suspect is complying. Get out of now. Fire. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Copy, Alpha Team. EMT standing by. Oh, come on. Are you trying to tell me this is... I'm not... Follow me. Yeah. They don't even have an animation for the arrest. It's basically just, hey, now now this guy is arrested, so... This is Alpha Leader. Suspect clear. And they're doing, they're doing what SWAT actually didn't do. Your trigger finger actually controls the report. So there's always a risk you will actually shoot. Oh, God. Alright, I don't think we got enough to recruit our next. Nah, we didn't. It's really too bad. We don't have enough to buy. So, we'll just play the story house. See what happens. Engage all suspect, recover all evidence, make sure report arrests. And we'll see if we die. There's a high probability that we will. Base to Alpha Team. We're good to go. Move when ready. Prepare for entry. Roger that. It would be easier if I could just have the second mouse button or middle mouse button control. Oh, look at that wind effect. A lot of papers wall blowing straight out from a wall. Try opening the door. Understood. Door is open. Yep, door is open. I mean, the game has some actual nice ideas. I don't. I just don't think it knows what to do with them. Get Put the gun there. down now. We gotta be. You stay there. Take it. Take it fire. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Are you kidding me? <laughs> they were on the literal conga line. I was using a silenced weapon and they were like on a fucking conga line to even get shot or shoot me. Seriously, I, I don't know how much more of this I can take. It's adorable in its own sense, but damn. You just can't make a tactical game like this. And I'm fucking glad I didn't pay more for this. Well, here's a good thing. I found a good thing. If the door is locked, you start unlocking it at once. And then have the option to, uh, to uh, open it. That's good. I'm gonna give the game credit where credit is due. I think that's two things I liked about this game so far then. Yeah, at least it has. I can. Put the no. gun down. Tank go down, and now the tankers are gonna come streaming in. Are they coming? Yeah, they're coming from behind as well. At least it's punishing. I mean, if I take a hit, I'm going down. But Jesus, this is this is hilarious. I'm gonna try and at least complete the training. Base reporting multiple suspects were spotted. Move with caution. Alright, so we're gonna place you to cover the area. Really, we should have just left him there so we can cover our back. Oh come on, the clipping issue all over again. And the way he's holding that MP5. Okay, so we have... The voice acting is atrocious. I mean, the officer was like... Uh, there's only one clip for everything. And they don't really know how to actually use their voice with authority. So it's basically like... Put the gun down. Like you're talking to a child. 
move with caution. Door is locked. I mean, I think it's good that I keep failing on these training Door missions unlocked. because it's kind of hilarious when I do. I mean, look at how this model looks. Look the, uh, about the fact that. Don't move. Get down no, now. No, no, this ain't happening. At least you can sneak up on people. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect clear. I can't Copy find this Alpha gun team. just because of that, but here it is. On me. Okay, so the other ones are not here. Good. Yeah, and this guy haven't seen me either. Put the gun yes. down now. Okay. Arresting. So far, so good. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect clear. Copy that, Alpha Team. Yeah, I'm pretty convinced suspect clear is not the proper term. Sango go down. Now we need to keep this guy covered while still watching the firing line for more of them. And of course the bullet doesn't penetrate the wood. <coughs> Arresting. Let's find let's find his gun. Oh wait, did he teleport away alright? No, he was just pushed this is into the corner. I can't find his I can't find his gun. And that's actually a bit bothersome. Because we kinda need his gun to this prove he was a threat. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Copy Alpha T. Copy Alpha T. EMT standing by. EMT standing by. There's not even a variation. It's not like a morgue on standby or a jail on standby or similar. It's always it's always just EMT standing by. It's not even trailers standing by. Okay. Okay, so that's where the other guys came from. This room should be clear now. Yeah, after we climbed over these guys. Suspect down. This is Alpha Copy Leader. Alpha Suspect EMT down. Standing by. Copy Alpha team. We failed EMT to collect some evidence by. and some officers were down, but at least we at least we succeeded in some way. Oh god, how many more of these fucking missions are there? And can I recruit another one yet? No, I can't. Can I at least give Thermite another rifle? That I can. No, I can't. I don't have enough money. It's only the silencer machine gun that actually seems to be cheap. Okay, so we have story house, multiple rooms, open rooms. And then we have the night house. You know what? We're actually going to go straight to a night in the, su in the suburbs and see what happens. Cameras captured. Yeah. We're gonna try this mission. Uh, because I, that's all I can take. I want to see how the actual terrorists behave in this game. And of course the loading time spiked. I'm fairly convinced... Uh, multiple suspects were spotted. Move with caution. Oh, and apparently the game has permadeath in stuff like this. Follow me. Copy that. At least they chose the first setting rather well with, you know, a standard house. But it doesn't look very convincing. Oh, and there's no doors. There's no door here. There, oh, wait, the door had been breached. That's actually a nice detail. Don't move. Get down now. Get oh, come on. I got that guy. It wasn't even a contest. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Copy Alpha Team. EMT standing by. Door 
is locked. Die, you. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Copy Alpha. I don't expect any nuance in this game. In, for example, SWAT 4, that could have been a bodyguard or the homeowner. Or just about anything that you accidentally killed, but in this game, like I said, I don't expect that kind of nuance. And that was what made SWAT 4 and similar games so fucking good. They had that kind of nuance. They had villains that were human beings. I mean, you could detest some of them, and some of them you could just scoff at, but... Some of them were actually trying to just, you know, be human beings, following their well. convictions and everything like that. I wonder, one of the things I am guessing about here is the fact that I don't think the AI can open the locked doors. Because we unlocked that. Besides, who the fuck has so many locked doors inside? Door unlocked. Now, the reason I think the AI is unable to open locked doors is because so far that guy was waiting at the other side of the door. Now, that can happen in SWAT 4 as well. But. He didn't open it. And in SWAT 4, the suspects can almost always open doors. Even. Oh, God! Ah, I gave the wrong order. Got it, boss. This is Alpha reloading. Copy Alpha Team. EMT standing by. I mean, I don't even know if we're actually Cabrera. going to find us uh, find some kind of hostage in here because so far it doesn't really look like it. Door is locked. Oh come on! How many locks do they have on the doors in this house? Door unlocked. Ah, this is all I can take. Okay, so there's a hostage. But there's no one guarding the hostage. I mean, she sits in the middle of the room, on her knees, with her hands over her head, in a position that's not logical for a person to sit, if they are... unless they are under a direct threat of force. This is Alpha Leader. Civilian clear. And apparently that was a mission success. With some kind of metal, I suppose. We still can't afford another operator. But I think we can actually afford the heavy rifle. I wonder if... No, we can't afford the heavy rifle. I wonder what the heavy rifle is, because it could be one of many things. Enter secret code in menu. To be fair, it looks like an AK, but... I can't switch my pistol. I can switch this. And I can apparently carry both a shield and... Oh, I need to buy extra ammo rifle for... Ugh, come on. And I have to buy it for each character as well. This is just ridiculous. Well, I'm gonna give you this quiet submachine gun as well, and then I'm gonna try Operation Silver Chair. Oh god. I mean, for the price it's not bad, but you have to consider the fact that I paid a buck for this. Based I paid a very literal buck for this. And, dangerous. Go with caution. and it's sloppy. I mean, this game is sloppy. There's no other word for it. Die. This is Alpha Leader. Suspect down. Follow me. Copy that. I don't really like how the game seems to pause every time you're supposed to give an order. Oh, and look at look at the flashlight. The weapon flashlight. We don't even have a flashlight on our gun. And yet... Oh, God.
Or, yeah, apparently the flashlight is, is mounted to our heads. At least that makes more sense then. They're not really replicating the sights well either, because the, you get the you get the feeling that the sights on the MP5 is just a hindrance instead of you know helping you to actually hit the target. Also, lo note how my shadow is interfering with with uh, and how big the shadow is from his weapon. I mean the. I don't really know what they were going for with this game, and at this point I'm a Door bit unlocked. too afraid to ask. Oh, and we actually managed to throw a grenade that time. And get this in disoriented. This is Alpha Leader. Civilian clear. Copy that, Alpha Team. How oh, good. At least we're doing fine so far, unlike in, you know, the tutorials. This is Alpha Leader. Civilian clear. But at least this game, unlike uh, uh, Player Unknown Battlegrounds, actually have a tutorial, so there you go. Door unlocked. Cover for threat. Copy that. I mean, it's almost impossible to move in a tactical manner. I mean,. Part of, uh, I've heard it's being said that part of what makes StarCraft a good commander experience is because it's not easy to be the commander. You're not given e tools that makes it easy. And this game is a bit in the same league, actually. Which reminds me, I actually have to pre-order the... the Remastered edition of StarCraft. Get out of there. Oh, this is a suspect. Don't want to kill you. you don't want to kill me? Please do. I don't want to be in this game anymore. Copy that. I don't want to kill you. Why is a suspect running around with I don't want to kill you? Of course you do. You are in a game where your objective is to kill me. I mean, why? Yeah, that's about all I can take from this little invention of Excalibur Publishing, so I'm just gonna quit it right there and go do something more productive with my life. <laughs>